Hi, I'm Marie. And I'm Bruce, and we are Freedom Fry. We're driving on Sunset Boulevard right now. We're taking you on a little road trip. We have a little surprise. It's that we are finishing up an album, and uh, we're staying tonight at the Chateau Marmont. We're going to do some recording in one of the rooms. Uh, the song West Coast is about that dream we all have coming to California about wanting to make it, whatever that means. Chateau Marmont is kind of synonymous with on your way up or on your way down. Like a lot of famous people have stayed there, worked there. It's a very local, known spot. It's 90 years old. I think it was fell into disrepair in the 60s and kind of came back in the 70s. Yeah. And uh, it's just been like a cool uh, hangout. I mean, if you've seen um, Sofia Coppola somewhere, uh, it was shot there. There's all kinds of legends about the Chateau Marmont that you can read online if you check them out. So it's kind of fitting that we're going to the Chateau with you being French and all because it was modeled after a French chateau. And it was named Chateau Marin because it sounded French. But it's not really. <laughs> Shh, don't tell anyone. It's still fancy, even if it isn't. How do you say California with a French accent? La California. <laughs> so much better. We're in a minute, we're going to be driving by the whiskey. And um, our first show, pretty much our first show, was at the Whiskey Go Go. Yep. And they actually asked us to, I think, buy 300. <laughs> yeah, it's one of those clubs where you have to pay to play. And we, we just started out, we were getting really frustrated because... We had to pay like no one 300 was bucks us. for like, the, I don't remember how many tickets that is. And you basically have to sell all of those 5, tickets. 5,000 tickets. And we did, so... Yeah, we, we sold them, so that was cool. And it was nice to play that club because the history with like so many of our favorite bands playing there. And so that was the very beginning of Freedom Fry, guys. And also, yeah, I think those clips are on YouTube, actually, if you yeah. want to see so the morning show. the morning show. See, there's a billboard for the morning show. Yeah, our, um, it's not our song, but it's a cover we did of Gorillaz. Gorillaz. Clint Eastwood by Gorillaz. Yeah. You came from France. Yeah. Do you remember your first time coming to LA? When I came the first time here, I was nine years old. And we did a little, um, um, yeah, West Coast road trip from San Francisco with your parents? to LA with my parents and my sister. And um, I was so excited. I was like, but I came to LA. I was super disappointed. Wait, LA. why? Why were you disappointed in LA? Yeah, because we were. We just stayed three days, I think, in Hollywood Boulevard, which is pretty dirty and I not love, that cool. But I now love I love. Hollywood but now we do. But for some reason, when I went there, I don't know why. But I do think it, it, you, uh, we like hanging out there because also we go to these cool spots. I think when you know it better, but when you come as a visitor and you just see the stars, it's fun. But you're like, oh man, I wouldn't live here, you know what I mean? It's like, it's yeah. very... Um, I love the seediness of it. I love that everything feels like a set. Yeah, the feeling that you can do anything you want or you can be whoever you want. Now it feels more like home than Paris. I think it took you a minute when you moved here. After you met me, he moved here yeah, like seven, kind of, six months after, and you, it kind of took you some time before I, you I fear warmed change. up to the idea. I was uh, in New York for like eight years, and I think when you're in New York, you, you just kind of diss LA. And so I was like, oh, fuck LA. I love, I love New York. I'm never going to LA. And my sister moved out here, and other people I was working with moving out here. I met you, and then I was like, yeah, I gotta, I gotta move to LA. And the first year, I didn't really have find my footing, and yeah. I didn't know my you way lost, around. You lost everything you had worked for that yeah. was based in New York, basically, and you had to build from the ground. That's it right there. Okay, so... So it's perfect. It's almost time for a check-in. Almost time for a check-in, yeah. And um, we'll see you when we're in the room, probably. Mama, I think it's kind of strange how the people always change like the seasons change.
recording my shaker magic moves. Shaker magic moves. And that's how you work <laughs> shaker magic. So we, we managed to record vocals and guitar and percussion because when you hear the song, those will be the actual uh, yes, the tracks we did here. So that's fun. Hopefully, hopefully we got some inspiration and put a little bit of vibe from this place into the song. I think we'll probably wake up really. <laughs> Is that for me? Is that for me or you want it? Can I have it? Thank you so much. You don't want to give it up? You want to keep it? Okay. That's fine too. You having fun? Wow, yeah, you are having fun. You like these hotels. You like luxury Hollywood hotels. <laughs> It's funny but it's true 